And the Republican budget plan also calling for deep cuts to the University of Connecticut. UConn estimates $300 million would be cut over the next two years. News 8's Bob Wilson is live in stores. A campus rally opposing the proposed cuts is about to get underway. Hi, Bob. Hey, you know, you know what? Yeah, that's right. Uh, at 6.30, this is going to be filled with students right now. they just rolling out everything here at UConn. They brought the stage out. They've got an electronic system here. They're actually getting ready to close the gate. They've got the pep band here. A lot of excitement. People fired up a lot of energy to let lawmakers know what they think. This is Aaron, a senior here. Uh, what do you think, you know, when you hear about, about possibly $150 million a year cut? You know, I just think it's terrible. Um, I've been going to UConn now four years now. My mother went here. Both my sisters went here. Numerous uh, cousins, aunts, and uncles. And you know, every year at UConn just gets uh, so much better. You know, with the news uh, coming out 18th among public universities, I think it's terrible that they would do these cuts. Uh, I think that UConn just needs to keep on getting better. All right, let's hear some tuba as we sing out here. This is pretty good tuba player. They're all out here, and they're going to let the lawmakers know they don't want their budget cut. Go ahead and let it rip. There, there you go. That's the note they're sending to lawmakers. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live here on the Shores campus. News 8.